How's everybody doing tonight? Good? Great, yeah. I'm doing fine. Thanks for asking. Dicks. Don't worry about it. Yeah. I'm just honored to be here among all these great comedians that managed to scrounge up eight bucks to be in this competition, so... <laughs> But seriously, I do have some great competition this, tonight. Uh, give it up for your other comedians, yeah. Give it up for yourself as well for being here. Yeah, yeah I, I, it's a pretty stiff competition. I'm a little worried. I mean, most of these guys have been doing it for many years. I've been only doing it for less than a year, since June. I mean, I've been wanting to do it for quite a while. I even remember going to watch this competition when it was at that dungeon they call Monks. But I, I finally worked up the, lurk, the nerve, uh... Last June, when I made a pact with my, one of my coworkers to try out the open mic, so I thought I'd try it out. I think I did okay. I don't know. Probably. I don't remember. <laughs> I'm doing better now. <laughs> but anyways, yeah. So I worked up the nerve to do that. I mean, I, and I enjoyed it so much, I thought I'd keep up with it, you know, and hope maybe I get some women or money out of it. <laughs> so far, I've gotten neither, so... <laughs> I mean, maybe if I do win this competition, though, I'm buying myself a hooker, so at least I can say I got both. There you go. Yeah, like, like any comic, I have my influences, you know. I want to be like Jerry Seinfeld with less airline food jokes, because I've never actually been on an airplane. Or like uh, Richard Pryor without using the N-word, because I don't think I can get away with it. I mean, I'm as wide as an albino polar bear, so... And maybe also like uh, Bill Cosby with less... Um, episodes of his hit TV show. <laughs> so I don't think I could do 200, 200 episodes of Rudy or whatever, is, whatever my catchphrase would be. Sorry, my Bill Cosby impersonation is awful. I'm no Kyle McAfee. So, yeah. <laughs> and this has no relation to comedy whatsoever, but that's why I have this glove. I got props. Don't worry about it. <laughs> But I, I kind of want to be like Darth Vader, you know, the, the, yeah, from Star Wars. <laughs> Which is why I always make like that gesture when I'm walking through the automatic door in a grocery store, you know, kind of like I'm using the force to open it. Does anybody else do that? Maybe a couple people? Yeah, I'm not the only weirdo, that's fine. <laughs> I mean, every, I, I don't know, I think it'd be pretty cool to be Darth Vader, I mean, besides from the massive disfigurement and the two kids, because I don't really want kids. <laughs> Especially a whiny little bitch like Luke Skywalker, so. Also, Princess Leia in that metal bikini would have me seriously considering incest, which, even a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away, I feel like probably not okay. <laughs> I mean, I feel like if I was Darth Vader, I would use that force choke all the time, you know. Somebody cuts me off in traffic? Force choke. Bad service at a restaurant? Force choke. My nephew won't listen to me? Force choke. It's not that I'm condoning child abuse, but if he deserves it, I'm even going to use it, so. Yeah, I, mean, I mean, if I did have the force choke, I'd probably force choking the chicken like two, three, four times a day. You know, probably force gripping the balls for more pleasure, like you do. I mean, maybe if I do enough, I'll just start shooting force lightning out of my penis, so. So ladies, if you're looking for a thunderstorm later, it's in my pants. Actually, that's not entirely accurate. It's more like a light drizzle in my pants. So I've never actually had sex, so... But when I do have sex, I'll probably have to text my friends during the act, just so they know. So if a tree fucks another tree in the woods and nobody's around to see it, did it really happen? Probably not, because trees don't fuck, but... I'm almost done, don't worry about it. I've never said that sentence to anybody, so... Anyways, anyways. My friends will be sitting around doing whatever they is they do when they're not hanging out with me. Uh, meth, blowing each other, working, because most of my friends are my co-workers who get paid to spend time with me, so... <laughs> They'll be sitting at home, they will check for me, mid-sexing. No preamble, you know, just right to the degree. Wah, wah. After two failed attempts, I've successfully entered her. Wah, wah. Thrust one. Feeling confident. Penis at maximum hardness. Wah, wah. Thrust two. Still confident. Penis as hard as Thor's hammer. Wah, wah. Hitting my stride. She seems to be enjoying it. Wah, wah. OMG. Just about. Wah, wah. Thrust five. Finished. 
All caps. Two exclamation points. <laughs> That's all I have for you. Have a good night. I'm Tim Miller.